the Kisi County Government Pending Bills Committee report of 9th of March, I have just been reading it, has got those answers. Okay? So, instead of delaying the meeting, you should have taken up and read the report to us. There are only two things I have seen, Mr. Governor. One, that you have 231, which is eligible. We can hold you responsible because you've gone ahead and made payments. The balance, so I want to move this committee, I want to move this committee that in our constitution, we invite Ongwai to come and speak to the 1.19 billion that was ineligible. But for you, we go to your report, Governor, on page 10, bullet 11, where you are telling us that all the eligible bills originating from the Department of Roads and Public Works be subjected to adjustment <coughs> specifically in respect of provision sums and quantities. And you have said, in other words, proper certification be done as per the law, customs and usages. So the question I want to ask you, having found this bullet 11 from this special committee report, why did you go ahead and pay? <laughs> because they have told you you only pay after you have done what is in 11. Which begs what Senator Onyonga has said, that, or was this report meant to help certain people to be paid, the beneficiaries of 231? Uh, honorable, yes. My, I, I just want to take up to the, the response that the governor has presented. If you look at uh, uh, paragraph 6 and 7, six. with regards to the ineligible pending bills, the government communicated to each of the contractors, suppliers, consultants on reason for rejection of their bills. Following the said communication, the government opened an internal desk to receive complaints, if any, regarding bills found to be ineligible. Now, how many, uh, maybe, how many have complained uh, about their bills being declared ineligible to be paid? Uh, and what is the, the status of, the, of that investigation? Thank you. Uh, Chair, I would have wanted, um, because it's under, domiciled under the county antony, uh, to respond. But indeed, there are those ones who have come up with claims. Not all of them. There are those ones... Uh, now those ones straight, uh, straight on the case were shown that indeed they are they committed crime. They have not presented their their complaint. Okay. Therefore, they have not come. Okay. But again, you know what Senator Aluale said earlier. Uh, there is a lot of monkey business in that in the, in the, in the, in the, in the investigated, and uh, you have seen it behind here in the report, Mr. Chairman, that we have given every reason for every rejection, for every ineligible case, we have outlined the reasons why they were not, they did not meet the criteria of eligibility. Therefore, uh, for Senator Faki, I want to say yes, a number of the people, they have, uh, the desk that we had set, they have uh, brought their complaints and they're being considered.